And that's when I thought I was a Southern Baptist sissy. Oh, good Lord. Oh, our friends are here, thank God. Hi, hey, guys. Oh, I'm hi. Katie. And I'm Edward, and you're watching Dear Rosie. The show answering questions from kids who had their first sexual feelings about their priest. Oh, bless you. <laughs> oh, boy, guys. Religion. Today's going to get real. Talking about some Let's deep shit. Out. Talking about deep shit. We have JoJo and Casey joining us in this discussion. Ah. But before we get to the real stuff, we do have a letter. Yes, we from do. From Danny. Uh, dear Rosie, I have to go to church every Sunday and I hate it. I don't like the stories the stupid guy reads in front, so I made up my own. The guy on the cross, Jeebus, <laughs> is Jesus. sad no one came to his birthday party. So his mom and dad invited all these strangers to come and stare at him and sing songs. Mom said my idea, my ideas aren't right. Is she right? Danny. Well, I mean, I, Danny, I like your version a little bit more, I think. Yeah, and I agree with you. I think church is pretty pointless. Church kind of sucks. Uh, but what about you guys? Uh, Casey, would you, uh, do you have a religion? Do you believe in some sort of secular? Well, my mom is a Jewish. So right. I'm half Jewish. Clearly. Half Jewish. You couldn't tell. Okay. I, I don't. I don't like to profile. So. Wow. I did. I don't see color. <laughs> I mean, yeah. yeah. You should. <laughs> but uh, I was never bots mitzvah. No, never bots mitzvah. So you've no. never become a woman. Well, I mean, I'll tell you after the show, but. <laughs> I don't mean. No, I guess not in the eyes of session. God. What about you, Jojo? <laughs> you have religion. I'm, I'm Mormon. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. So yeah, that was definitely known. Yeah. Are you uh, Are you excited to go on your mission? Yeah, I want to go space. Ooh. I want it to be a mission mission. <laughs> they mission, have yet mission. to send any Mormons to space. So. That That's very true. Us. That you know That's us. accurate. <laughs> Not, Neil Armstrong could have very easily been a Mormon. Keep that shit on the DL. <laughs> what do you talk about? What are some of your bullet points here, Jojo? What? what? What are like good Mormon ideas? Um, whatever you're thinking, push it way, 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 way back in the back of your head and don't talk about it. <laughs> okay. Actually, I think I like that. Religion is kind yes. of a tough thing to talk about, but we're going, before, let's preface this with, we're going oh. with our yes. experiences with religion. Yes. We're not demonizing anyone. No, 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 no. What um, were you raised as? I was raised Catholic. Same. And what are you now? Atheist. I hate saying it. Yeah, you're not I very just confident sound like in that such an Because every atheist, every person yeah. I've heard who goes, I'm an atheist, is like this asshole that you just don't want to talk to. But I would say I'm uh, still spiritual. I wouldn't say I'm a, a Catholic, but I would, I don't know what that means. I guess you could say you're know. agnostic, which is even more annoying than atheism. Yeah. Well, I don't believe in God, but I believe there's something. something. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck? Let me preface the conversation with a question, though. Sure. And uh, you know, we, we won't like this question, but if you have the choice now, <laughs> yeah. in this day and age, can you, if to wipe out religion from education and every, like from everybody, would you? <laughs> Jesus Christ. That's such a bold question. Yeah. I guess what my opinions of religion are is I think that it's great if you have faith and spirituality and you believe in something outside of yourself, but I think organized religion just ruins it all. I feel like it's been constructed in hist historically for our people to be oppressed by it, essentially. And being someone raised Catholic and going to Catholic school, you don't see anything but that shit. I personally don't have an issue with religion. I think I have just, I think the issue comes from just humanity in general. Yeah. I think people just ruin religion for people. That's 100% <laughs> yes. true. Um, right? But if I had a yeah. choice, I would keep it. And You'd I have, keep it. I, I have reasons. I acknowledge that they've definitely like caused a lot more bloodshed than anything. Like it's sure. a lot more issue than the maybe. Crusades, yeah. <laughs> Spanish Inquisition, <laughs> all of it. <laughs> um, but I would say, True. okay, so like this is just like a bold answer, but I would say we probably wouldn't have a lot of our literature without religion. In like eighth grade English, all you did were looking at themes, and all the themes were uh, biblical. Yeah. Adultery. The Bible is a nice foundation for a lot of literature in general. And basically, it's like the OG of the soap opera genre. Mm, I mean, you yeah. read the Old Testament and shit gets real. I also feel bad because I feel like my perception on organized religion or religion in general is very skewed because I was raised in like a Catholic school system. And mm. I fought against it a lot because there's a lot of parts of Catholicism that I don't like. The church, in my opinion, when I was growing up, was just constantly like yelling at me and it was rules and restricted and I felt very like out of place in that world and I felt like Catholicism is not very receptive to like no. new ideas and new concepts. Although they did change some of the words to say, and with your spirit, 
which is very new agey sounding. So way to go, Catholics! <laughs> and, and Catholic church is so boring. Yeah. It's all the it's, same. You don't need to go every Sunday. Do you it's know really that weddings, funerals, communions, Christmas, regular mass, all the same. It's all the same service with just long. a couple things. Some are just longer than the other. <laughs> it's fucking annoying. Like the at funerals will basically be like, now we're going to have communion. So you're having the body of Christ while the body of your friend is like right up at the front. <laughs> it makes no fucking sense. Casey, when was the last time you went to church? Went to temple, I guess, because you're oh, half Jewish, but I don't know what you practice. No, I don't go to any type of building. No. For things. Does it go? Anywhere? You don't have to go to any buildings? No buildings. Freestanding <laughs> structures only? Yeah, exactly. Totally, I get For that. For the indigenous people. <laughs> Casey doesn't believe in walls because they just keep her in. But I've been to like, you know, weddings and stuff at Catholic churches. Okay. And, and they're I boring, aren't I they? I go up for the wine, but not for those crackers. I feel like they could just put some salt on it. The body be much better. Is or like some dry. jam. <laughs> Like a little bit of jam. You could do the body of blood of Christ all in one if you just put a raspberry jam on there. That, that looks like is it, rude? Blood? is it rude it to be does. like take the body and then be like, can I just dip it in the wine? It's <laughs> salsa. <laughs> body of Christ. It. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Dip, 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 dip it, dip. Eat it. I stopped going to church because the people that went to, that I would go to church with are always the most hypocritical. I and stopped I, going because uh, my mom got sad when she would bring us because we would all bring a book and read it in the back. <laughs> that is so rude. And she would be the only one that was like actively interested in it and the rest of us had a book. I would be pissed about your mom. I feel like our generation might be the first generation where religion is like not important. Not important. really not important. Yeah. But I would say I would be very proud if like nativity see, like sets everywhere actually like made it more uh, accurate in what baby Jesus would look like. Oh yeah, I mean that <laughs> white people white being everywhere. Yeah, I mean that'd be a nice <laughs> like, thing, a nice step in the right direction. Yeah, I think that's what they would. I feel like if people were trying to bring religion back, or at least for our generation, they need to be a little bit more appropriate. I think they that. need to tie in celebrities into their nativity scenes. I think we need to make all the nativity people look more like famous celebrities. Ryan Gosling. Ryan Gosling, baby <laughs> Jesus, Joseph, uh, Joseph Ray Fiennes, um, <laughs> Mary. Um, Meryl Streep. Meryl Streep. Yes, yeah. 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 is right. The three wise men. Ooh. Ooh. Three men who were in a boy band. So why don't we give up some, our final thoughts on religion. Let's sum it all up into a nice, tight, concise argument. Who wants to go first? Jojo? Um, Talk about it. I think that whatever gets you through life is okay. You can That's great. believe what you want to believe. Go to where you want to go when you die and all that. Yeah. But that doesn't mean everybody else has to hear about yeah. it. That's a big, Absolutely. big point right there, Jojo. Whatever it takes to get you through your existence, which is a very difficult thing to do, whether that be religion or whether that be celebrity pop culture news <laughs> like me, do it. Just find the thing that you enjoy. And if you need to have faith in some, that there's something else beyond us, then fine. Right. Just don't tell me what to believe in. And I want to tell you what to believe in. Yeah. You do you. And maybe Catholics, like, ease up a little bit. Yeah, take a day. Yeah. Take a chill pill. So back to the flying spaghetti monster. Oh, yeah, so let's talk about it. In the sky. Do you wear the, 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 the thing yeah, on your yeah, head and then you can celebrate it and dip the spaghetti? If you like what you see, please subscribe. Here. Maybe here. Oh. Here. Also, for other content, like us on Facebook, King's Fifth Productions.